Hey gang, what's going on? Hope everyone is well. Today in my world, not sure about when you're watching this, but it is the last day of 2019. That's insane to me. It's been a time, it's been a year, it's been a month, it's especially been a week, and it has especially been a day today. Anyhow, without further ado, I'm getting into this video because from everybody that I've spoken to about my channel, whether this be my subscribers, my friends, my family, my business coach, everybody wants to see more vlogs, more days in my life. What do I do? How do I live? I am a holistic health and wellness coach. I am not a part of any MLM company, nothing against them at all, but people keep asking me, well, how do I work from home? How do I make money? What do I do? How is my life so crazy and fun and interesting? So this new year, I'm going to show you what my life is like, and it's not that crazy fun interesting to me, but I guess to others it is. You know, we always have lives that we think are meh, but Everyone else's lives always seem more interesting, so I am letting you in to mine this coming year with some more vlogs. Today, though, it's New Year's Eve, and I am off to a 90s party of all parties, and I can't wait because I loved the 90s. I was born in 83. I'm 36. So, you know, in my 80s, where eh, I wasn't even old enough to enjoy the 80s during the 80s, the 90s is where I grew up. And so I'm excited about this party. I have my outfit. Let me show you it. All right. Right. So, I am doing the classic super baggy jean found at the thrift store with the plain white tee and the spaghetti strap over top. And Claire's accessories totally came through for me. I got jelly bracelets. These chokers, remember these guys? Hugely 90s. And, which I thought was 80s, but I guess it is the 90s and I can't even get it out of the bag. Hang on. A snap bracelet. And as if it's not only a snap bracelet, it's a mood bracelet. So it changes colors with my body temperature. I know mood rings were big in the 90s, but you know what? We're going to make do with that. Anyhow, 27 bucks for these three things. Buy three, get three free. Okay, but I don't need three more of these things. Anyways, my dilemma at Claire's today. We're going to put this on. And not only are we going to put that on, but I am bringing a classic tonight. It is a appetite potluck and I thought well wouldn't it be fun if I brought something that was somewhat 90s so this here this is Dunkaroo dip with Teddy Grahams and animal cracker dipping crackers what so I'm gonna steal the show with that and I'm also gonna show you the recipe for that it is not gonna be healthy okay could be way worse however times like the holidays I live 80 20 Dudes, I'm telling everyone live 80-20. So I'm not being optimally healthy. We're gonna make Dunkaroo dip. I'm gonna wear this amazing outfit with my awesome, way too expensive random Claire's jewelry. And we're gonna get this party started. We gotta go to the store though. Time's a ticking. Look at the size of Cool Whip. I cannot use a liter of Cool Whip. My goodness. Well, I think I'm probably failing at the vlogging business. I just drove around to three different grocery stores and I'm not sure if because I'm in Canada, people like to use a lot of Cool Whip. You can't have a pie without Cool Whip. Cool Whip? Cool Whip, yeah. You mean Cool Whip? Yeah, Cool Whip. Say Whip. Whip. I'll say cool whip. Cool whip. Is this a Canadian thing? When it comes to weird and wacky, the Canadians have it all. I don't know. I've never used cool whip, but the three stores that I went to want you to get a whole liter. Excuse. When am I gonna ever eat that? As opposed to the eight ounces that I need that is in a normal container, apparently. I don't know, anyhow, I added up all of the other ingredients and then I thought, oh my goodness, this um, Dunkaroo dip, like I'm not gonna eat that. <laughs> There are a lot of people at potlucks. Everyone likes sweets. It's New Year's Eve. However, do I know that anyone else would eat that either? I don't. So, you know what? I grabbed a fruit tray, a pre-made, ta-da, it's already done. Super simple. And we're just gonna continue to get dressed up in the 90s. And here is the recipe for the Dunkaroo dip, should you want to attempt this yourself. <laughs> 
Okay, the Dunkaroo dip. You're gonna need one box of Funfetti cake mix, and if you're like me in Canada or somewhere where they don't have that, confetti cake is the same shiz. Eight ounces of light or fat-free Cool Whip thawed, and then one cup of non-fat plain Greek yogurt. For dipping, you're gonna want either Teddy Grahams, graham crackers, or animal crackers, which I think would probably be the best idea if being most authentic, and then some extra rainbow sprinkles should you desire. Mix all of that together and you've got your dip. The recipe is linked below. So getting the snap bracelet on my wrist with you actually seeing it with only having two arms is next to impossible. Um, P.S. This, now that I'm looking at it through the camera, you need to get one of these. It is made for a soft tissue. You can use a tennis ball, but underneath your, whoop, nope. Underneath your foot, anywhere, oh my goodness. It releases all of the connective tissue in your entire body. Majorly, majorly good. Anyhow, so hey, this is the 90s outfit. We have the plain white tee. I'm not sure why it was always plain white. If anyone knows any reason why that should have been, let me know. The spaghetti strap on top also... I learned that it had to have been a crew neck and it had to have been a spaghetti strap like this top. Again, I'm not recalling. I think I was maybe in grade seven when I wore this kind of shenanigan. Anyhow, we have the plastic chokers. Can you see that? Yeah. And then we have the baggiest of baggy pants. These are from Esprit, right? Was that not the 90s? I don't know. I found these at Value Village, which is Canada's favorite thrift store. I washed them and dried them, which made them a little short, but I am wearing docks. Although, I mean, I wear docks this day and age. I don't know if you had to be in the 90s, but this day and age, I wear docks. So don't listen to me. I'm not really an influencer. Just saying. <laughs> This is what we've got. Do you want to even see the back? Probably not, eh? Like, boring. I have sparkles on my eyelids. Oh, yeah, you can see that. And this metallic lipstick that I remember in the 90s was the shit. This is what we're going with. And you know what the best part is? I am going to a party prior to the 90s party, including folks that are not a part of the 90s party shenanigans. They haven't even met me before. Talk about first impressions. Any who's. If you can think of a game from the 90s that you loved, like a board game or, you know, I'm thinking about Girl Talk where you had the pimple stickers, but if you can think of a game, Mall Madness, wasn't there a dream phone also? Okay, these are all little girl games. I was a little girl in the 90s. How old am I? According to my birth date, I'm 33. But as a millennial, I don't identify with that age. If you have any game ideas for adults that were adults in the 90s as well, please let me know. Comment them below or send me a message. And I can't wait to hear your suggestions. And we are off to this party. If you thought by any random chance in the entire world, and I don't blame you if not, but that this video was helpful, informative, or entertaining at all, please hit that thumbs up down there. That lets me know what kind of content to keep producing for you. If you would like any further content regarding healthy recipes, healthy hacks, healthy diet and lifestyle, however you want to live and lose weight in a way that actually works for you and your lifestyle, please let me know. Comment below. Send me a message. I don't know. You can find me. I'm all over Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, you know, all over those social medias. And I hope to talk to you soon. Take care. Have fun. Happy New Year's Eve to you. If you would like notifications of each time a new video is posted, please hit that little bell at notification icon down there and you will be notified each time I upload. Please, please subscribe and share this channel because other than silly videos like this, there are videos on this channel that can and will help heal more than 90% of any health, wellness, or body image challenge. And until next time, have super amounts of fun in your life. Have super amounts of fun doing things like this. Just have fun, and I'll see you then. Bye. Apparently, it's a musical. They reach a peak of intensity, volume, and emotion. And when it gets to that, that is when the woman's tone of voice changes. Who is this person? I've never heard anyone who talks like this.